This is very intelligent not doing another Blitz video. I have a little bit less time today, so we're going to do a three minute game. Uh, probably see a little less commentary and uh, probably a little worse chess, but we'll see. Uh, so, looks like we've got a game, and I'll uh, try and do my best to uh, show something pretty cool. I'm going to go ahead and play the English Open as I usually do. This is called the Reverse Sicilian when they open here with the E4. Alright, I'm going to try and play as quickly as possible. Uh, I'm not very big on pre-moves just because I find that I uh, make some big stupid mistake and then uh, ruin the position that uh, otherwise a half a second might have uh, left me in a, a winning position or something like that. So. Pretty normal position here. Um, I'm going to try and put the rooks on this open B file and try and take advantage of uh, the space that I might be able to get here. Um, crap. See, there you go. Hung a piece. That's part of this whole uh, blitz chess, is that you end up playing uh, bad chess in a lot of ways. Probably a bad move. It's going to end up hanging this piece and opens up the king side. In general, it was a terrible move, but at least I'm hitting this knight here. Maybe I'll be able to get some play on it. And now he's defending well, and uh, he's playing very well under the uh, the time pressure, which is good for him, not for me. Um, So I'm going to see if I can get a little sneaky tactic in here somewhere and, and get this game back. But for the moment, I am. And uh, the problem is, is, if I take here, I may win the piece, but he's going to take with the queen. I think I'm right. We'll see. Not much time. And we're going to try and play quickly and play well at the same time, which I know is terrible. Um, and uh, the only reason why I went for that over here is because the queen's covering uh, this square, which may end up giving me a chance. Just trying to maintain a decent position here. Um, we're back to even now. Um, hmm. Getting to be a, a dangerous looking position here. This is uh, this is the square that I have to worry out for because it's going to be able to uh, check and uh, I've got about 20 seconds, so I need to play something quickly, regardless of what I do. takes care of a lot of my chances that back row mate is going to be a 
big part of what would have saved me in this game. Um, I don't have enough time, so I'm going to sacrifice the Rook, see if I can get some quick play in here, and uh, try and uh, create a position where he drops something hazardly. time. So three minute games are a little faster than I like and uh, probably a little too fast for me to do commentary on as well. Um, looks like ideally I might end up having to slow this down to uh, 10 minute games for me to give decent commentary and uh, to play a, uh, a reasonable game of chess. Um, in reality I may even be better to uh, go ahead and uh, slow it down to even 15 minutes. Um, may get a little bit long for a YouTube video, but it'll at least uh, uh, give a, a decent game of chess and uh, dropping pieces and move 10 is, is, is not what you want to see and not going to teach anyone anything. So I think I'm better off uh, trying to play better chess and uh, if people want to watch it, that's what they want to do. But these fast games aren't, aren't letting me see anything and they aren't helping you. So. That's that, and I will uh, load this up and see what everyone thinks about it.